CJ Champion is now one of the greatest professional dunkers in the world. He actually started working at Hoop Brothers before he was a professional dunker, so I've had a lot of time to work with CJ one-on-one, -on -one. and him and I recently had a keynote speaking engagement where I was giving a speech and he was dunking at the event. Um, and we were talking about professional dunking in general and whether or not professional dunking should be an Olympic sport. So I'd love to know, Tristan, what are your thoughts on this topic? Do you think professional dunking should be an Olympic sport? I do. Um, you know, they have to train. Uh, it takes the art and it's something a lot of people can't do. So um, and it's entertaining at the end of the day. You know, it's, it's so far. In my opinion, it's been way better to watch a professional dunker than NBA dunkers, hmm. and especially after the last one. I didn't even watch it, but I saw the highlights, and it was trash. Trash. The last yeah. couple dunk contests, yeah. yeah. The NBA dunk contest doesn't compare to professional dunking. No. It can't. They don't train the same way, mm -hmm. so I agree. It should be its own sport uh, in the Olympics because... They're a unique type of athlete. Mm -hmm. A basketball player is training their entire game where a dunker is training dunking specifically. Mm -hmm. There's trick dunks that you have to train for. It's very different. An NBA player is not preparing for that. Mm -hmm. um, and it is an elite skill and it does take the same level of discipline as an athlete to get to that level. So I don't see why it shouldn't be an Olympic sport. I think the biggest question in the dunking community and why it, maybe it hasn't become an Olympic sport yet is how do you judge it? How do you make a consistent mm -hmm. judging for dunking? So when you think about that, what comes to mind? How would you judge a dunk contest in the Olympics? Um, I guess it would literally have to be um, like almost like horse. <laughs> mm. If you think about it, like, you know, if, if you're a dunker, uh, the judge, I mean, to make it even fun, if you can do this dunk, boom, 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 you make it look better. And then I think that's the best way to judge it, you know, mm -hmm. if, if, you know, just like, for example, when, um, you know, jumping from the free throw line is, 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 it used to be like, can't nobody do that. Right. Now you see people doing it between the legs and it's like, <laughs> what the hell? So, you know, things like that is like, will really separate the professional dunkers and like the really professional dunkers. Like, mm -hmm. cause it's like, you know, now, now you really got to judge based on you know if you can do it or not i think that, that that'd be an interesting way to do it like mm -hmm. a horse competition so they one dunker does something and then if the other dunker can't then mm -hmm. they get a letter or something yeah. something along those lines i could see that being uh being effective um i would say i think the the scoring i don't know how they do the scoring in like snowboarding or mm -hmm. uh dance or things like that, mm -hmm. that they have i know that they have judges and scores so mm -hmm. i would imagine they could do something similar for dunking where certain yeah. tricks are given different scores or uh, the reason I think horse might not work is style. Yeah. Like style and power. Like yeah. if one person jumps from the free throw line and just dunks it, another person jumps from the free throw line and punches it yeah. and it's more, more stylish. Yeah. It's a better dunk. And outside of just dunking, they also do need to, you know, have uh, uh, crowd control. So that's a big part of, you know, the, the whole dunking aspect is how entertaining you are while you're dunking. So uh, I think, I think I, I guess it is overall performance and a judge can, can easily see, you know, who's the better dunker. I mean, it's not just, it's just like basketball. You, a lot of people can make it, but it's a lot that goes into it. Like the business side, the marketable, like it's, it's, it's a reason for it. So I think a lot of the, the dunkers, from what I've heard, mm -hmm. uh, the spotlight put on dunking tends to be like the TNT show that they had where they had Shaq and Kenny and Charles judging the dunk competition. Mm -hmm. Jordan Kilgannon, who in my opinion is the best dunker in the world, mm -hmm. on that show was saying that the judges don't understand professional dunking because they're NBA players and basketball mm -hmm. players, not dunkers. Which is bold to say to Shaq and Charles yeah. Barkley. but. Yeah. I think there's truth to that. I mm -hmm. think that there are levels to professional dunking, and it's not the same as just dunking a basketball in a basketball game. Mm -hmm. There's unique skills involved with that. So I think the judges would also have to be uh, previous dunkers. Yeah. I think they'd have to be aware of what a dunk takes yeah. in order to, that to makes, judge it high. Yeah, that makes total sense because it's like you're really separating a traditional thinker and then actually like someone who actually has done it. So it's just like, yeah, it's just the same way with basketball and the fundamentals of the game. You, 
you judge a player on how fundamental they are, but then once they start acting like Kyrie, it's like, ah, pass right, the ball. Right, right. So, but hey, Kyrie, you want to code us in the NBA, but that's a whole other topic. <laughs> <laughs> but, well, yeah, dunking, I definitely believe should be an Olympic sport and uh, should have dunker judges, professional dunking judges. I agree. What, what do you guys think? Should dunking be an Olympic sport? And if you have an event coming up that you'd like to have a professional dunker at, let us know because we'll definitely hit up CJ Champion and see if we can get him to come out to your event. So let us know. Let us know. Drop it in the comments. Bye.